Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. The Plants Rift has just come out, so let's get into the video. Alright, so if we go into Wizard Watch, you will see a post that says, Step into the Plant Rift and see what's inside. Something magical is growing. So, let's go ahead and check this out. I assume you can only use plant pets for this. I don't know how many I have, um, but it seems like we can get some Magi coin. And then the second one will give us Clip Clop. Um, okay, so it's only Ice Pets. And do you... Oh, yeah, I don't have any keys. I was about to say, you have to spend Magic Coin to go in here. I forgot that you can get keys from doing battles. So I need to go do a battle so that I can get a key. Alright, so I got our key. And I'm also going to go ahead and put on some ice stuff because we will want to use that when we're in the rift. So now we should be able to go ahead and go over to Dragon Isle and I think that we can play this rift now. So I don't know any how many ice pets that we need. I don't know how many I have. For the second one we're going to need 10. Um, for this one I don't know how many you're going to need. But... Um... Your team is more likely to hit with their spells. Well, that's kind of already a thing that's in the game now. But all damage dealt to the player's team. Yeah, we probably just want to go for this. Um, our bullseye isn't that game-changing. In fact, it's kind of, like, useless. Um, I have a lot of ice sneaks. I guess I'll just use one of those. Because... I assume these guys are going to be on, like, level 20, probably. Maybe level 30? Uh, level 70. Okay, that's actually kind of surprising. But I think we still should be fine. Um, our ice sneaks going first. Somehow it has the highest order, even though it's on level 1. But that's fine. Yeah, there it goes. We should still be good, though. Um, let's go ahead and use Chill Out right here, and it will hit Batterbot and not take it out quite yet. Um, I think I'll use Starbit to just go ahead and take out the Batterbot. I think that's its name. But yeah, there we go. Now we're in a pretty good spot. They heal Dreamlet for some reason, and then Dreamlet will go, and yeah. Um, I'm probably just gonna skip to the end of this battle, cause not really anything else interesting will happen in this battle, I think. So yeah, I'll see you guys at the end of it. So I think the strategy for rifts now are to go for the ones that say enemy accuracy up, because those don't really matter anymore, cause they got rid of speed, so everything hits now. Um, I don't think accuracy really matters at any anymore, unless it has something to do with dodge, which I don't think it does. So, I think you guys should probably go for that, if you can. Alright, so yeah, that was the final hit in this rift run, so... I think that we have the chance to get Magicoin coin from this. Um, that'd be pretty nice if we did. It looks pretty rare though, yeah, I barely... I only saw two that whole time, but we did get the magic coin. I think the rates for the special items are higher in these rifts because they're limited time. This one's only going to be out for seven days. Um, I don't really know if I have enough ice pets to go on to this next rift, but let's go ahead and see. Okay, we do. So from this, we could get Clip Clop. Um, there may be another one or two special things that you can get from this. And then the next one will be Magic Coin. I do own 15 unique ice pets, so I will be able to play at least the next rift. Um, enemies get fewer critical hits, we're fine with that. And your team has a chance to miss with their spells. Um, let's see if you can actually miss with your spells, because I really don't know if you can. And for my pets, I think we're just going to go with an ice sneak. I have a lot because I was getting them so that I would be able to use Ice Sneaks for coin grinding inside of Firefly Forest, but then they changed um, everything in a combat update, so now Ice Creator isn't that good anymore, so I really don't have a reason to merge it now, which is a little sad. But these guys are a little better, they're on level 90, so this might be a little harder. I might need to use some slightly 
better pets, maybe not rely on level 20s, but we're still in a pretty good spot. Um, they're going to go ahead and heal the Palm Pringle, which is fine. And yeah, I'll see you guys after this rift ends. Also, you can probably use these speed ones to your advantage, because those also um, probably don't actually do anything anymore. So that's another thing that you can do. I think I'll use Ice Creator this time. All right, so we were able to get through that rift as well. So from this, we can get Clip Clop. There might be something else that we can get. Um, I don't know. It looks like Clip Clop's the only one, and that's what we ended up getting. Um, not really a great reward, but it's fine. We're going to move on to the next rift. I forgot what's in this one. I think it's Magi Coin. Um, we can also see what's in the rift after this, which is just Florence, and I don't have enough ice pets for that one. Um, let's go ahead and do this third rift, though. So, these ones are fine. We're not going to use any water spells, probably. So, um, for this, I kind of need to be a little smarter with what pets I'm using, because they should be a little better. I guess we'll use this level 55 ice creator. Because I'm going to try to get through the next rift, which could be a little bit more difficult. Um, these pets are on a level level 110, so we do need to be a little more careful going on. Alright, so this is probably going to be my final rift that I do, because uh, I kind of drained through all my pets. And we're not doing too good on this one, it's not good that, we're gal or that Shiver Tusk only has one I spell because I have two uh, things that make it so my physical spells are pretty weak. That was pretty clutch that Dreamla did that. And that might take out my Glimmerwing. No, it does not. Glimmerwing will survive at least one more turn, which is good. Kind of have to go for Mistile, I think, right here. That's kind of what I'm going to have to do, yeah. Um kind of just need the wizard to survive a while because i can get to an all-out attack which will hopefully get us in a better situation than we're in right now um maybe we take out mistile right here um it's gonna be kind of close though i believe i don't think it will do enough though yep so i have a feeling glimmerwing is gonna get taken out right here um, yep, there we go. So, Glimmerwing is gone. Um, Shiver Tusk also has the potential. No, he is not this round. Um, so, let's just go ahead and take out Mistile. I assume Shiver Tusk will get taken out next turn. So, I think we're in a pretty good spot. This should do about a thousand damage. 1337 is pretty good. Um, so Shiver Tusk should be gone right here if they go for it, but they go for the wizard. We are in a pretty good spot now. Um, as I think I said, I'm not going to do another rift after this because I pretty much have no pets left. We'll use an all-out attack right here because I think this will do more than Iceberg will do. Um, only 1937. Normally it does about 2200, I think. Um... We won't win the battle this hit, we should win it next hit, unless this does something crazy. Yeah, 1040, about what I expected. And we should just have to do one more the heal, so we might have to do two more hits, I don't know. So we will go with Iceberg, and then we'll go with Frost Spear. Only four health left. So we're gonna go with Frost Spear right here and we should win the battle. I don't know what any of their rewards after this are. Um, the Ice Rift, I believe it was. Okay, so there is something new, the Verdant Globe. And then I think you can also get Magic Coin, yeah. So, I think the Storm Rift had some, like, Chibrella, um, Relic, and Hat, um, for your pets. I don't think that that is the case for this. It could possibly be, though, because you can get this. And then I'll get the 20 ice pets, because I will eventually need to get them. And 
that will hopefully allow us to see what's in the next rift. Somehow I also completed a couple of things for the treasure track, which I guess actually I do know which ones those are. So the Rift Event Shop is a decent place to get these. Um, I don't know how many I need. We can spend a little bit of magic coin though, since I have a lot. I think I'll just buy these three, and let's go ahead and head back to see if we can. There are, should also be a few in the pets center that I can get. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna get the last few in the pet center, hopefully, if there are ice pets. So yeah, there is a cheap ruckus. Hopefully that was the last one that we needed. We may need just one more though. I have a feeling, yeah, we're gonna have to buy one more pet from the Rift Event Shop, which is a new shop, by the way. If you need to get any new pets that are for the Rifts, you can just go ahead and head to all shops, go to Rift Event Shop, and this will allow you to get the elemental pets that you need for this, but it does cost magic coins, so it could be a little expensive. I think in total we got a net zero gain on magic coin from doing these few rifts, and somehow I don't have 20 unique ice pets. I think I bought a duplicate ice sneak or something probably, which is a little annoying, so probably I need to buy one more pet. Alright, so we were able to get to the next one. Um, I think this is the final rift because you can only get up to rift 4, there's no arrow and you would be able to see what the next rift is. So I guess rift 4 is the final one. There's probably some pet gear in there for you to get. Um, I don't have the pets to be able to do that right now, so yeah, that is going to go ahead and end the video. Let me know what you guys think of the plant rift. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and bye.